Okay, so one, that was adorable. Two, that actually brings up something that I've been wanting to talk about for a while. Um, so we as humans domesticate animals. It's just kind of one of the things we we do. We've always done. We've domesticated dogs before written history. Um, we domesticated sheep near the beginning of written history. We've domesticated dozens of animals over the, the centuries, millennia of our existence. So in a and d world, why wouldn't other races do that? If humans can do it, why wouldn't the other races also domesticate things? So specifically thinking of that raccoon. Goblins. Goblins are usually portrayed as conniving, thieving little craps that just want to steal stuff. And are usually a menace. Uh, they're dangerous, but they're not like, I'm going to wreck the village and kill everybody. They're like, oh, I'm going to kill a few people in the village. We're going to steal a bunch of crap, and then we leave. Have you ever seen what a raccoon does? I live in a relatively rural area most of my life. That's a raccoon. Like, to the T, that is what raccoons do. They get in your garbage, they steal crap, they're dangerous, they kill chickens, they kill cats, they sometimes kill small dogs, and occasionally they'll attack humans. Even though we're bigger, we're stronger, and we're intimidating. And they don't care about us as a predator. Like, they look at us, like, have you seen some of the videos on here of raccoons just making eye contact with people and being like, yeah, this is mine now, and I'm just going to take this with me. Like, they're, they're goblins. So... Imagine goblins having domesticated raccoons to go steal stuff for them. They've trained them to go into small towns and villages and grab the shiny stuff, grab the garbage, grab the refuse, take some chickens with them, so that the goblins don't have to go anywhere nearby because humans, we see a raccoon and we're like, oh, wild animal, maybe we'll take a pot shot at it, but we're not going to like go out of our way to kill it like we would a goblin. And I imagine most of those civilized races would do the same thing, like... Oh, it's a raccoon, it's just a natural animal. Well, no, it was trained by the goblins to steal your stuff. And that's what it's doing. And having this symbiotic relationship like we do with dogs and with the wolves that we domesticated originally as hunting companions, using the raccoons the same way, I think the goblins could have a lot of fun and it would be a very interesting flavor to add in. I have more of these ideas, so stay tuned if you find that interesting.